on guys welcome to davis drives i'm aj tim roll the intro Like I said guys, I'm AJ, and I just want to give you a little bit more in depth of what we do here. We sell cars, boats, bikes, anything on wheels or water, anything you can ever dream of, we have it. But that's enough for me. Let's go grab JW so he can explain some more to you. Hey JW, you in here? You know we're supposed to be filming today, right? What? We're supposed to be filming today. Oh my goodness. Did you wash your hands at least? Not yet. Oh my goodness. Alright guys, sorry about that. Uh, I forgot about the filming today, but uh, we're going to bring you a, a quick episode on some of our in stock, ready to go tow trucks. Not wait on, not have to order. These trucks are here on the ground. We'll have AJ do a little demonstration on a couple of them. Only a sample of about the 50 to 60 that we do have in stock, but we want to show a quick variety of some of these trucks. We're also going to travel across the road, which is literally across the road, and we're going to give you a little glimpse of our commercial facility, which is finally coming to fruition after many years of hard work and uh, painstaking ideas. We finally have everything pretty much put together for that, so let's get to it. All right, so we're going to bring you some commercial tow trucks. This is a little bit of an unorthodox tow truck, not on the commercial level, more on the personal level, but just had to sneak this one in on this video. This truck is probably one of one in the country. It's a custom built six door excursion. There's other six door excursions. Every one of them is built a little differently. This truck rides on full air, front, back, even the cab rides on air. You can consider it a limousine. You can consider it a tow truck, but for your boat, your camper, your RV, if you've got any of these big boy toys, this is the monster you've got to have. Shaq actually had one just like this. Might even been this one. I'd have to look back at the pictures, but uh, they are the big boy toys. You do not duplicate these things for less than about $300,000 new. So this one right here is a hell of a deal at 100 Built, done, ready to tow immediately. No, no excuses. Zero. It's ready. So let's get over to some of these actual tow trucks. This one here. Still a little unusual. This is a Lariat, crew cab, wrecker, twin line, Jordan bed on the back, uh, MPL body. So that is a very desirable body wrapped around a Lariat truck. So all the bells and whistles of your luxury truck you're driving personally. So that's a great owner operator truck. All hands down, ready to go. We'll go inside real quick. It's got a Jetty cups, it's got the towing of apparatuses, it is loaded up with gear. Even got the big screen in the dash. This truck's like sitting at home in your own luxury couch. Look at the back, it's got all the gear ready to tow. This one comes with a uh, front view or in cab camera system, tow strap. The boxes are loaded with towing gear and safety apparatuses and all that. Going right across the way here to another very high end. This is a Dodge. This is a Laramie. Um, had almost a hundred additional lights, strobe lights, LED lights. One of the most desirable bed bodies there is. The truck's got drop down outriggers on it. Of course, twin line again. Have a tunnel box. Uh, probably a one of one build in this color with these options and uh, all the extra lights again. You can build a truck any way you want to, but this is a show truck, but a working man's truck at the same time. So, owner, operator, or a really good employee. I would just give it to your normal Joe Blow guy. Hidden away dollies, you name it, it's got it. We'll come along to one of our standard rollback builds that we have dressed up a little bit. We got in the ditch cone mounts, the in the ditch uh, fuel saver. You can use that for water, diesel, gas. 
can add a couple more if you want. We've got everything in stock, all the products. This unit is riding on a set of 22 inch alloy wheels with heavy ply tires. So it's still functional as a tow truck, but has the look of, again, a personal truck. Uh, steel bed on that one. It does have the in the ditch toolbox set up. And, uh, all the amenities ready to tow, fog lights. We've got these trucks ready in stock, gas and diesel. I've got about 10 of them, so pretty good layout there. And of course, hands around, you'll see we got them tucked everywhere. And this is just our get ready side. We'll go over to the commercial side. This is where we do final prep, load them with the chains, get them washed, center caps, quality control. These are all getting quality control done, just making sure everything's there, all the gauges are working, get fuel in them all the safety gear, towing gear, everything that we equip them with, and check out the lights. You know, things happen. These are new builds. Uh, in most cases, things do happen. The used ones the same way. We want to make sure they function and work. So this is our prep process area. We'll see one other little uh, diamond in the rough sitting there. That is a brand new Platinum that just arrived. That truck's got six miles on it. That's a 22 F450 Platinum with peanut butter colored interior special name for it but that's what I call it panoramic roof every option that truck is one that you will not find I've got four dealers calling me for it if somebody's looking for a personal use truck it's here it's in stock paperwork in hand you can own that truck today versus waiting a year for it like we did so we'll go get ready to go across the street I'm gonna show you the commercial facility give you a little bit of new news on what's happening over there made our way across the street this is what's going to be known as Davis Auto Sales commercial headquarters as you can see in the background this 100 by 100 building which was a construction company thank goodness directly across the street from the car lot finally after many 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 years of working on getting this deal done it's ours so uh, we're going to start remodeling and changing even though we've been using it now we can officially make it ours and make it our masterpiece that we want it to be what you see in the background right here, if you will follow our social media, if you don't, you need to, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, make sure you're on our pages. This area is going to be lined with some of the newest lifts out. There will be cars stacked in here three tall. We have four lifts currently, three cars high. This will be glassed front. So when you drive by on the road, you're going to be able to look in here at night. It's going to be lit. You'll be able to see our exotics and our classics, a lot of things that right now we just don't have room for. So we've got them tucked in this building, tucked in that building. we got them everywhere. This area also, aside from that, will be some office facility overflow for some people in the office. We're going to have a little bit extra storage on the other side over here. We'll get a couple glimpses in there. And then uh, let's take a walk inside the building. So we're over here in the commercial building. You'll find Uncle David over here quite a bit. He's getting ready to head out to lunch. So we're not going to interrupt him but so bad right now. In here is where you'll find a lot of our ATVs, UTVs, side-by-sides, dune buggies. Also where we do the assembly for the Orion Reapers, our dune buggies that we sell new, currently out of stock. One of them in, we'll be able to show you in the background. Um, every now and then a couple classics are in here, but the main part of this facility is going to be for the actual building of tow trucks, equipping of tow trucks, and also another big gas building to get inside of with uh, without the weather. Over here scattered, which is not organized currently, but this is where we keep all of our in the ditch products, boxes upon boxes full of all the newest gear, toolbox organization, straps, chains, rags, safety gear, gloves, 
box is full of camera systems, um, several hundred thousand dollars, believe it or not, of just what we give away with our tow trucks just to equip them. Um, this area will be shelved, so this will literally be an assembly line. We'll run through here, we'll pull all the product. If a customer requests something custom, we'll pull it from the end of ditch gear, dollies, whatever they're requesting. Of course, that stuff adds up. It does cost extra, but depending on what your build is, we're going to be able to equip you. We'll have it in stock, on the ground, no waiting. Um, all our local guys are really excited about that and our non-local guys because if they give us a day or two heads up, we can go ahead and get the truck equipped the way they want it. They come pick it up. They can go to work immediately on their way home. So, uh, Also in here, those lifts we talked about, a couple of them have showed up. Taking up a crap load of space currently, but uh, these are going to be the triple stack racks that are going to be installed up front. In the background, you see a whole bunch of miscellaneous stuff. That is one of the Orion Reapers over there waiting on the motor and transmission to arrive, and that's going to be assembled and done. Uh, hopefully springtime we'll have those back in stock again as well. ATVs that are getting assembled, we got a few of those left, some dirt bikes that we sell, uh, and then just a laundry list of side-by-sides, crazy amount of side-by-sides right now, everything from one of the most tricked out, yeah, I spent fifty or $60,000 on that Can-Am Bandit Edition. Um, same deal with this Turbo Razor right here. Just ungodly amount of money. These are not stock units. These are built, not backyard built, not put tires and wheels on built, truly built, suspension, everything done, units, and a couple stock ones too. So we get a variety of everything across the board. So glad we could show you inside here a little bit. This area is going to be changing rapidly, but we wanted you to see a little before because we're really proud to bring you the after. So crazily enough, in the background, you're going to see all these racks. This is the back side of our building, which we will be customizing with a pretty cool, don't want to spoil the surprise because even my employees don't know what we're doing back here yet, but in the 80s, maybe even back to the 70s, all the way to about 1990, this was a Sea Ray dealership, literally across the road from our dealership, which is cool. A little before my time, so I don't remember all of it, but this was a legit biggest Sea Ray dealership around, one of the only dealerships for boats around, and they stored boats in the front where we showed you, which we've taken the racks out. They stored boats in the back. They assembled boats right next door and they rigged them inside this big building. The coolest part is the people that I purchased the marina from were the same family that owned this facility. So when the father retired from here, the son opened the marina. When the son retired from the marina, I purchased the marina. Now have purchased this property. So full circle, pretty cool. Um, great people uh, both like I said retired love their businesses love their lives um, and I do remember when this was a Sea Ray dealer and of course we're a boat dealer also so kind of cool uh, bringing it all together thank y'all for watching this video today uh, hopefully brought y'all some stuff that you haven't seen about Davis Auto Sales one last area that we're in this is another I think this building's about 80 by 80 this building is also was used for a construction company but you can see it's our overflow storage currently this area will eventually get enclosed and uh, have a lot of good, good ideas in here too. This actually may be one of our areas for our boat sales. Um, but as you can see, even after 47 years of us being in business, things are always changing. And we always have something to add to the equation. Very, very fortunate to continue to grow. And we want you guys to be able to see some behind the scenes of what most people don't get to see. Customers typically don't come over here. If you look at this from the road, you just see a building, uh, but a whole lot of history whole lot of excitement, a whole lot of steam behind us, and you get a chance to ride along to see what's happening. So we appreciate you watching. Continue to subscribe to the channel. Hit our Facebook, our Instagram, our TikTok. You'll see uh, AJ taking a lot of that. You won't see a lot of me because I just don't have the time, but you'll get to know my guys, which have all been with me for a long time, and I want you to be part of the family. Thank y'all for watching the channel today. Be sure to click and subscribe, shoot us a comment, whatever. We'll try to be very interactive on here. As you can see, product is rolling in. This one just got the call that it's sold, so AJ's getting ready to prep this one, get some tags on it. We're gonna get this one ready for the new owner. Catch you next time.
It wasn't recording. We got to do it again. They stopped? No, I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs>